What's going on guys? My name is Phil and welcome back to Metal Gear Solid 5 Side Ops. Um getting away from that depressing statement uh, that I did last time. If you guys watched it, it was my spoiler video. Um <clears throat> involving, you know, just me like talking about like the end game stuff and how super sad it was and stuff like that. Uh, but yeah. Uh, today we're gonna be doing some more more of like just building up mother base in general. My main objective at this point is to make sure my mother base is Basically build up to about level 55 on each of the things. Um, if you do that, um, I should be able to develop everything there and for, in fact, getting, like, every trophy in the game. Um, I also really, 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 really want to get, I don't know if I can show you this, this assault rifle over here. I really want a silencer for it. There's no way to get a silencer until, like, level, like, 50 million, which is kind of upsetting. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be doing that today. Um... So, to, to build them up, basically, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do these uh, wandering base uh, levels. Or these wandering, not wandering mother base, um, wandering puppets. That's what, that's what they are. And by doing this, I'll be able to, you know, I'll... Gosh, I'm tripping over my words today. Uh, I'll be able to, you know, put them in the... They'll, they'll be in the brig, essentially. But at least this way, they'll be, they'll be there. Um, I did beat the game. Uh, the full main story is completely completed. Um, it was one of the, yeah, it's like one of the saddest things I've ever done in my entire life. I also love this bandana, it's so cute. It look Dee Dee, she's adorable. Um, trying to, like, tiptoe around these spoilers. Um, I can just tell you right now that the armored vehicle and the armored tanks missions are gonna be a lot more harder than they were before because of, uh, reasons. Um, uh, hopefully Konami, that, they know exactly what I'm talking about, um, Patches it back in. Kind of wish I got the PC version of this now so I could just manually mod it myself. Uh, but that's that's not it. Um, there's like, I think I got like 10 more of these missions going on. And then like literally the rest of them were just like 10 just random missions. Probably like prisoner pickups and stuff like that. Um, but I'm actually, yeah, like, uh, like I said, I'm almost done with this entire game. I've, I've done close to, it says I only did like 50% of it. But that 50% of... Like, what I've done is, oh my god, like, 80 hours, I think it was. Maybe even more. Probably going on 100 hours at this point. But, yeah, my guy looks awesome. My mother base is doing really well. I'm starting to see how Metal Gear 1 plays out because of, like, all this stuff I'm doing. And it just makes so much more sense because of that. Um, but, yeah, it's 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 great. I mean, this, this game is... If I see, if you guys see some, like, little, like, cutouts and stuff like that, I think it's my TV or it's, like, something to do with stomping. Like, if someone, like, stomps on the ground, um, you can hear that. Uh, but yeah, this, this game is, this game is phenomenal. If you guys haven't picked it up already, do it. It's, I, I cannot say enough good things about this. And the cool thing about these missions, like I said earlier, and probably a couple other parts, is that these missions right here, there's no reason to, you know, like, there's no reason to, to be, you know... Like, not be hostile or or anything like that like you can literally just you know just take these guys like he'll he'll do that for a for a while and knock him out he'll he'll keep hitting his buddy but it won't matter um bring these guys out here is usually what i do and then since you have to either put them in a chokehold or shoot them in the head um I usually just do that, and then it brings me both these guys. Also, a dude coming this way. Uh, I'll take him out, too. So, let's examine these guys and see if they're worth our time. Um, this guy's really worth our time. This guy is, too. So, we're going to fold and extract these guys. And since they're all A-pluses, and usually 90% of the time they are A-pluses, my base is just going to grow significantly. Um, it's kind of cool, because when you beat the whole entire game... And I'm talking about, like, the true ending, not the not the one that, you know, ends, like, the main story with Skullface. Um, you get uh, you get these S-plus people, or no, S-plus-plus plus people. So it's really, really cool how that plays out. And I was really like, oh, yeah, finally I get these guys. There's seven of them this time. That's that's kind of sad, because I like I liked having more than them. Come on, come out in the open. Do your thing. Do your thing. Don't you, yeah, fall forward. That's what we need you to do. Also, these guys, you know, chilling. What are you guys doing here, hanging out? A plus plus. I love how it's just like you just punch them in the head. Like that's that's how you deal with these fuckers. Is you just you just don't you just punch them in the head and then they're good. And this guy, he's not he's nothing. Uh, unfortunately, some of these guys won't be as good as like 
the, a lot of the ones you'll find, and you'll kind of get some duds. Um, what the cool, the good thing is you get to re you can replay these missions as many times as you want. You just have to wait till like a time period. At least from what I've seen, I've replayed a mission like five times just to get this one guy until I found out about these. Um, so you're not you're not stuck. Also, I think this is the mission. I think this is the place where you get cause. Like I'm almost 100 percent sure this is where you this is where you get cause originally. What about this guy? No, he sucks too. Great. So I, but the good news is I got about um, five, maybe four, of them. So a majority of them. One, two, three, four. Oh, sorry, I did get five. Cool. So I got. Five. He's actually a lot better than what I got last time. Um, so we probably have enough time to do you know one more of these. Also, I've been trying to level up my uh, base as much as I can. It's super, super hard to level it up after a while. Like, it starts requiring stuff that takes forever to, like, grind up stuff. I have two forward operating bases, though, which is the good news. So, um, I get supplies at a way, 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 way faster level. Um, and then, then that, that meant retrospect, anything I don't need, like, surprise-wise, um... I can just sell, and then I can get, you know, get more stuff. Can I, can I use my Phantom Cigar here? No, I can't. But we're, uh, there's a couple, there should be more side ups that just pop up now because I do that. I also got two more of these. I want to know what 142 is, and then 150, I believe. 51. Um. Where does it say, like, aw, that's a sad mission. But, I want to know what, what some of these are, because if you, because some of them are yellow, which you're, like, the... You know, the big deal ones. I got one D-Rank guy. Great. Volunteers for days. Everyone wants to be my buddy. But, yeah. the more And the more forward operating bases you have, the more, like, people you can have in your uh, your base at, the, at one time. Did I get any new missions? Nope. No new missions. Let's take a look at my staff management, though. Because got to be right quick. Uh, do 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 Trouble Baker. Can't have you here. Selection. Sorry, buddy. Uh, dismiss. These guys are really good. Unfortunately, they're all in jail. Um, eventually, they, you know, they come out of jail and they're they're way happier with life, which is kind of funny because I'm rescuing them from being a zombie. So you know, they would probably be a little more thankful. But whatever, that's just me. Um, yeah, these missions are really really simple. They're more just like grinding for mother base soldiers. It's and they're really late game missions too. So I think they did that on purpose. So that if you wanted to, you know, get that, you can. Um, I'm also looking forward to getting that infinite ammo bandana, even though it prevents you from getting an S rank. Um, it'll help with the objective parts of everything, because I know that, uh, I know that when you get, when you get the, I don't know if getting objectives and S rank is a separate entity, but it's, it's really, really, really helpful. Can I skip these, by the way? No, I can't. And, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna use that Infinite Ammo Bandana. Probably the Stealth Camouflage, too, just to get all the objectives done. And if I get, you know, at that point, I just get A ranks and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, some of these, some of these missions get really, really ridiculous. Um, like the extreme ones, like, especially, like, fighting quiet on extreme difficulty. That was one of the hardest things I've ever done. Just because of, like... How unforgiving it gets. Are these people... Are these zombies? Yeah, these are zombies. Cool. They're all just chilling over there. There's in the middle of the forest. It's kind of perfect, actually. But, um, yeah, they're just... She... One shot kills you from her, and then you can't really do any of the tricks you did in the original one. Like, in the original Quiet Mission, you, you know, you could just... You just get shot for days, but as long as you recovered, you were fine. In this one, I'm pretty sure she's using her really powerful sniper rifle. So... On top of like you know being her being super fucking strong, um, she's she's even better than she was before. So you got you got to kind of watch out for that. Um, but yeah, that that was that was one of the highlights. Um, and then you know there's so many there's so many things to do in this game. It's it's ridiculous and it's kind of weird that I'm coming to the end of that. You know I've been I've been playing this game for oh god like close to. Almost 100 hours. And the fact that I just now I'm starting to like starting to hit the, you know, I'm about 80% done with the, the actual game itself. A lot of the other stuff is like um, objective base and stuff like that. Oh, it's a good puppy. So it's going to be, a lot of that is just grinding. Ooh. This guy. 
Oh, nope, gonna just choke him. I have to choke him out. Because I can't, you know, you can't kill these dudes. I don't know if this counts as, yeah, you have to, it looks like you either have to kill him or extract him or it doesn't count whatsoever. And it's so cool that you, that you just, they just let you do this, like, this is one of the easiest ways to, you know, grind up people for your base. And it's like, oh, yeah, like, you don't even need to do anything. Like, half of these people, they, they don't, they don't stop the Fultons, they don't do anything like that. There's eight of them, usually, and 90% of the time, they're all, you know, they're always really good. Like, that guy's A++, and he has the Diplomat trait, which is probably one of the, the best traits you can have. Um, because it stops Troublemakers, which you can never have, like, you know, you can never have enough Diplomats on there. Um, and if you eventually troublemakers won't even be like yeah, that's even better a plus plus and everything and he's uh pretty sure he's R and D too um, But yeah, it's 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 so great having these kind of missions just ready for you um, oh, What is this dude did I check him yet? Oh this guy this guy's not that great. He's you can you know, if there's anything more than if it if it's a plus or below or if it's a or below I usually don't bother because at that point it's 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 almost a nuisance. Ooh, there's one more. Oh, okay, no, it's right there. It's just right there. Cool. But yeah, it's it's really it's really cool that they do these kind of things because that way you know you can build up mother base faster. I'll, I'll probably have to do this a couple times off off screen or whatever to eventually get all the soldiers up to it. And that and at that point you get like A pluses guaranteed and A plus pluses on some occasions. Like this time I got two. Um, last time I got one, and the time before that I think I got maybe one. Um, so usually you get at least one A plus plus, which is at, at some point your whole team is gonna be have to made up of either A plus pluses or you're gonna have to upgrade your base to like hold like 200 people in the same department. So the R and D is just like boss status. But yeah, wow, I'm hungry, guys. Um, but yeah, anyways, don't forget to subscribe if you guys have any ideas for games I should play in the future. Leave them in the comments below. If you guys could toss me a like, it would help me out so much. Other than that, guys, stay classy.